Today, we're going to make some self-starting siphons. Please have an adult next to you while you do this experiment for your safety. First, I'm going to get the big pipe and put one end into the water. And you can see that the water level of the pipe is the same water level of the cup. Because the air could escape and water could come into the pipe. So that's why the water level of the pipe is the same water level as the cup of water. Now I'm going to get the big pipe out of the water and I'm going to get my thumb and cover one end of the pipe and put the other end into the water. And you can see that the wa there's no water in the pipe because I'm closing one of the ends with my thumb and there's air trapped into the pipe so no water could come into the pipe. And now I'm going to let go of the, of, my, of the pipe and you got to see what's happening over here. Whoa! The water comes up higher than the water level of the cup because the water, the water went into the pipe and the water had momentum so it came higher than the water level in the cup and came back down. Now I'm going to do it again so you can see it again. I'm gonna put the other end into the water and I'm gonna let go. The water went higher than the water level of the cup because when it let go the air could go out and the water went in and it had momentum so it came higher than the water level in the cup and came back down. I'm going to use the momentum of the water to create a self-starting siphon. So first I'm going to get one end of the pipe and close it with my thumb and I'm gonna put the other end of the pipe into the cup of water and now I'm going to let go. Whoa! Water is coming out of the pipe! So cool! Why that is happening? Because the water goes into the pipe and the water in the pipe has a momentum so it goes up to the pipe and goes down to the tray. I'm going to try making this clear pipe into a self-starting siphon. So I'm closing one end of the pipe with my thumb and I'm going to put it into the water and I'm going to let go. Whoa! Water is coming out of the pipe. Why? Because some water goes into the pipe and when it's in the pipe, it has some momentum so it goes out of the pipe and onto the tray. I'm going to see when is the equilibrium point. So I'm waiting and water is coming out of the pipe. I think it's gonna take some time. Now water has stopped coming from the pipe and the equilibrium point is when the water level in the cup is same as the exit point of the pipe. I hope you enjoyed this experiment. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to our channel, Kids Guru, for more fun science experiments. See you next time. Bye!